Good morning, beautiful people. Good morning, good morning. It is Saturday morning, and here I am again in the car. But today we're not running errands. Um, the plan today is I am actually on my way to oh, it's better to my um to my daughter's house to help her pack because she will be moving um i think we're gonna actually move some stuff out too we're gonna put whatever we can put in the cars and um let the moving people do the big stuff you know the wash and dryer and couches and beds and stuff like that so whatever boxes i meant to clean my trunk out dog it And then, like I said, let the moving people do the big stuff. So, y'all, I'm turning around. I gotta go get this stuff out of my trunk so I can have some room. Um, um, so she went yesterday, her and a couple of her friends went yesterday to actually clean up the place. It's a really nice place. It's real nice. Only thing is, it's just small. Um, <clears throat> because she kind of had to move, like, I want to say in a hurry. So, the place that she was living in, she was renting a house. And the people actually sold the house. So, she was trying to uh, get somebody to... Uh, Whoever the buyer is to actually let her stay, and then y'all, it was a whole lot of crap with that, whole bunch of rigmarole stuff with that. So she was just like, "Forget it. I'm, I'm not finna keep going through this." And just found her place. So she's downsizing quite a bit. It's okay. She has a goal in mind for the next year or year and a half, which is really good. Okay, guys, I'll be right back. I gotta get this stuff out the trunk, okay? Okay. So, I don't really have really nothing in the trunk I had a crate with uh, a crate with uh, some car stuff uh, you know jacks and stuff I mean what you call that jumper cables and windshield things and all that stuff got some chairs and I had some rotors and I was gonna take the chairs out but I'm like no I think I should leave the chairs in there in case we're at the new place and we don't have nowhere to sit. So I left the chairs. But I took everything else out. But uh, anyway, so as I was saying, so she she's downsizing, um, which she really don't like, but you know, when you come from a house to a little smaller place, you, you know, you gotta get rid of some stuff but she does have a goal in mind for the next year or year maybe two she does have a goal that she's reaching for and uh which is good 
So my first stop is gonna be the gas station. Cause I got to get gas. If I'm gonna be driving around the city. So, uh, yeah, so anyway, I'm gonna get gas. Then I'm gonna head over to her place and um, I'm gonna try to get some footage. Um, I'm gonna get as much footage as I can. And um, I'll see you guys in a little bit. So guys, I was just um, looking through the footage that I got today. And, y'all, I did not have the microphone turned on. I don't know how I forget that. I did so much talking, and we had so many conversations, and all of that. <clears throat> and I didn't even have the microphone turned on. So, I'm going to have to do a voiceover. Um, and I hope that the voiceover is in the right spots so you guys are gonna have to bear with me okay so yeah I'm gonna um look through the footage again and put the voice over in and yeah hopefully it come out right <laughs> okay guys okay okay guys so um I just arrived at my daughter's house Walking up the stairs. Um, here I'm just checking to see if the door is unlocked and it wasn't. So of course I had to ring the bell. I have no idea what I was saying right here. I hate that I actually um, lost all of the, well actually not even lost, didn't have the recorder on. Yeah, guys, so that really sucked. So, um, actually her and I are having a conversation on her ring doorbell. <laughs> and then she told me to use my key, so I just used my key. Um, yeah, walking in the house now, kind of looking around, talking to her. And I'm showing you what she has packed up so far. Um, so we still have quite a little ways to go. Yeah. And I think we're holding a conversation right here. She's upstairs and I'm hollering uh, through the house. Um, I don't know what she was doing. So here, um, I'm in my granddaughter's room, looking around, and y'all, and I tell you, it's a hot mess. It was a hot mess. She just literally has stuff everywhere. <coughs> so look, I'm trying to take some of these pictures off the wall. And they was up there really, really tight. And the reason why they were up there so tight is because she had them up there with duct tape. Look, see, she had them up there with duct tape. Great duct tape. Who does that? No, so this is me just trying to pull the tape off the picture without ripping the picture. It came off uh, with no problem, though. And I think I'm taking more pictures off the wall. She had pictures everywhere on the wall. So that's what I'm doing here. Um, I think I'm going to speed up the process now. And then I will get back to you guys soon. 